So I just got done laying out this basement according to my little uh, computer image here. This little plan, um, I always whip these up for my clients uh, on a little program called 3D Home Architecture. Uh, it's real simple to use. You can learn how to run it in a couple minutes. There's a lot of uh, store box items that you can buy like this program. You don't have to get 3D Home Architecture. I don't even know if they make it anymore. <laughs> That's how old the program is. But there's a ton of uh, programs that you can buy to design floor plans. And uh, you can get those like Staples or Office Max, any of the big uh, office supply stores. They normally have them. Or any place that sells computer software is going to have some, some version of some uh, program that you can buy to design your basement. Um, or you can have somebody design it for you and work from his plan. You can see this one has dimensions on it. I'll zoom in here a little bit. There's dimensions on here that the program puts the dimensions on it and uh, makes it real easy for you then when you're, when you're laying out the job. So what I did is I took the, uh, the floor plan that's in front of me here that I designed for my client and I transferred all those wall lines onto the concrete floor this morning. So uh, we'll take a walk around here and you can see, I can zoom down here and you can see all the red lines. Uh, they represent all the exterior walls. They're all four and a half inches off the, uh, the main wall. And you can see here we've got um, a little closet laid out here. And I'm just taking a quick run around here. We're going to work our way around these pipes here in the corner. You know, we can see we got a, a problem in the corner here and we've got a window up above this problem. And if we go to our plan, if we go to our plan, we would be right here in this corner right here of the plan where I put in a, uh, a little corner box that I'm going to build here uh, on a 45 that they're going to put a TV on top of. Okay, so this is the corner that I'm in right now. And we're going to work our way down this wall over here. You can see a really big um, closet right here game closet that's uh, 12 feet wide by 3 foot deep and that's down this wall that we're going to go down right now. And this just continues on down the red line right down here to this 3 foot by 12 foot closet that we've laid out here. And I show you how to lay out walls in the uh, framing series videos that we have uh, put together for you guys. There's four of those and I think the framing video, it's the very first framing video in the, of the four in the series that will show you how to lay out your walls. And uh, you can purchase that at basementfinishingvideos.com basementfinishingvideos.com and uh, just go to the uh, framing video series and uh, that's all in there for you. And over here we had a bedroom that we laid out and at the very end over here, where the ladders are, we've just got done laying out a, uh, a bathroom with a linen closet. And uh, we've got a shower down here. And you see, <laughs> you can make that out there. We've got a toilet down there on the floor we've laid out. So today, uh, basically, we stock the materials and we, and we chalk all the lines on the floor in preparation for the uh, for the actual framing to begin. So I don't know how much actual framing we'll get done today. Well, we'll get a couple walls up, but tomorrow we'll hit it hard. Uh, but, uh, you know, it's, it's going from your design to the floor on day one and laying out the job. And if the layout's wrong, the job's wrong. So you want to take your time and uh, really, you know, double check your measurements, make sure everything's square, make, make sure everything is just like the design on paper. Just transfer those lines, transfer the design to the floor, and uh, once you have that completed, you're, you're ready to start building walls. So uh, this is day number one on a brand new job in Carlisle, Pennsylvania. Uh, it's right outside Carlisle. It's uh, Boiling Springs, and it's for the, uh, the George family. Thank you.